Question, what is the best basic operation of math? That's a ridiculous question. False, addition. That's debatable. There are basically two schools of thought. Fact, addition is excellence. Addition, excellence, seventh grade math. Math is not. What? What's going on? What's going on? Last week we were in Dollar General and we saw these khakis, uh, $6, and it only cost us $7 each to recreate this rest, the rest of this ensemble. That's a grand total of beep boop beep boop, $13 a piece. You know what? Imitation is the most sincere form of flattery. I thank you. Identity theft is not a joke. Millions of families are affected every year. This is Jensen! This is Jensen! This is Jensen! This is Jensen. Oh, real Jensen. funny! Jensen. Mrs. Jensen! Mrs. Jensen. Mrs. Jensen. Mrs. Jensen! Would I rather be feared or loved? Easy. Both. I want people to be scared of how much they love me.
kids, everybody pencils down. We've got lice. No! No! What? Lice? Lock the doors. We're on full quarantine. Check me, check me. Let me see, let me see. You're clear. This is the cleanest scalp I've ever seen. Should be. My mom makes me use lice shampoo every morning. Check me, check me. Oh, yep, this kid's got lice. Big time. Right next. Let me check you. Come here. Oh, that's a big one. Yep, you you got lice. Next. Hmm. Oh, yep, more lice. This one's got a big one. All right, last one. Oh, yeah, even bigger. You got an infestation getting again in there, girl. You might want to check that out. I wash my hands at least six times a day, Clorox wipes to my desk, yes, toilet seat covers, yes, apparently neither was enough protection. Is there anyone else lice free? Okay, I'm going to need you to grab your belongings and retreat to the playground. You can conduct your business out there until the infected have been de-loused. Scalp leeches, skull vampires, follicle magnets, one thing is clear, we must remove them immediately. Actually, my family's had them before. It's a nuisance, really. It's not that big of a deal. We just need to wash our hats and coats. And remove all your hair. So we just need to get mayonnaise. It helps suffocate the little guys. And it's not like other shampoos that hurt your hair. There is no need to remove your hair. So boom, how do you like me now, Lice? <laughs> Take a picture, it'll last longer. We don't want to take a picture, it's a little scary. Yeah, I'm the only one tough enough to show those lice who's boss. Okay, it's gone too far. If everyone just follows my instructions, nobody else needs to end up bald. Not that it looks bad, Mrs. Lemka. I mean, you look fabulous. I lied, it didn't look good. She was bald, I couldn't find a single hair on her head. Anything you want in your jello. I love some classic lime flavor. What is this? Cut! Go oh my god, how did that happen? I actually don't know how that happened. Jello goes great with everything, even staplers. That's no way to address a coworker. Whatever to you too. Whoa, 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 what was that all about? You forgot, it's your 40th year here at CLJ. Go ahead, I insist. Basically, when the celebration committee got into a fist fight over the red velvet cake last month, they were asked to step down from the party planning committee because there was too much drama. So apparently we were appointed heads of the committee. It's humiliating. So this is my 40th year here at CL Jones. I've been so nice and friendly all year long and nobody has said anything. There hasn't even been a party. I just think sometimes people are mean. Come on, 40 years? That's how many, what, over a thousand Mondays? And I've been wearing these same ugly sweaters for 40 years too. I can't believe nobody has noticed. Are you kidding? Well, I'm not done yet. Mrs. Gray, this fits in the palm of my hand. Why, why are, why did you choose this, these colors of balloons? Well, they match the carpet. What is that? It is your 40th anniversary, period? It's stating a fact. 
This is more professional. It's not like she's been here for 50 years or anything. I can't believe how bad this looks. You're an English teacher and you've even misspelled words on this poster. Are you trying to make me feel bad? Because if so, you're succeeding. Happy 40 years! Surprise! Hey, this isn't a surprise. This doesn't look good. What? You have a cake and your name's even spelled correctly? Wait, Mrs. Jacobson, you haven't even heard our theme yet. You don't hear a theme, you see it. What's this Rice Krispie square on my cake about? That's the best part. That represents a television or a pillow. Our theme, if you will. Well, that's the fun part. You get to choose between an hour of television or an hour of napping. That's our theme. Cool! Really? I love it! Yes! Okay, so what's it gonna be, Barbie? Well, I've been tired all week, so I choose a nap! Okay, nap it is. Everyone out. Get out. We'll eat that cake at our desk. Out, out. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Okay, nap it is. You've got one hour. <sighs> thank you. Thank you. <sighs> Congratulations on your 40 years, Barb. Oh, I'm too excited to sleep. This is so awesome. Great cake. Thanks. <laughs> 40 year celebration time is over. Now get back to work and make up all the time that you lost while you were napping. 40 more happy years to you. Favorite thing about teaching art? My favorite thing about teaching art is that I get to see almost every single student in the building, which is amazing. Probably just to make music and have fun. Thing to do with your class. I enjoy pushing my students outside of their comfort zone. Favorite thing to do with your PE classes? Um, my favorite thing to do with PE classes is to join in with them and play whatever we're playing. And I thoroughly enjoy drinking uh, my coffee while watching them.